Alright, the next race is the Clipper Logistics Handicap, a one mile event, 0 to 110 for three yards and up. One is Gold Touch, Leon from Resbrook, two Maximus Wildman, Paul Rhodes, three is Closely Guarded, Craig Allen, four Endangered Beast, Dan Hughes, five is Escapist, Leon from Resbrook, six Great Point, Dave Udy, uh, seven Great Power, Dave Udy, eight Miss Mary Poser, Patrick Hogan, nine Sarticular Impressions, Edith Liggett, Noret for Martin Leedham, Proud Tarquin, uh, Kevin Milligan, Ilara Monarch, uh, Graham Clutterbuck, uh, Carrick Australia, Patrick Hogan, Ensign Spark, Kevin Milligan, Again, and future speed Alex Cherry the six fifteen horses they're not really coming from the back at York for some reason the York track in game uh, does not favour hold up horses um, horses need to be handy to have a chance in most cases but away they go and out wide endangered beast for Dan Hughes has taken it up early from Maximus Wildman who passes that and Paul Rhodes from Maximus Wildman goes to the front from endangered beast in second on the road is Cairo Crusader in between horses the red colours the yellow cap of the Retva uh, just on that one's outside is great point for Dave Hoody on the inside of that we have Escapist for the from Reisberg in between horses the green colours of Prato Con um, out wide the second of the Patrick Hogan horses Miss Mary Poser. On the rail we have CJ Liggett's horse, which is a uh, Sartigli impression. On the outside of that is uh, the orange cap cap and orange sleeves of future speed. Then comes a uh, out very wide gold touch who has on his inside uh, closely guarded. They're followed by great power in the back of the field and stone spark for Kevin Minigan. But Maximus Wildman is open up by four lengths here from Cairo Cassidy in second. Uh, on the outside of that is endangered beast. Then comes Escapist, followed by um, Naretva uh, trying to run on his future speed for Alex Cherry in between horses and um, very wide at the stages of Miss Mary Poser but it's Maximus Wildman who leads with three phones left to travel here comes Cairo Casada for Padre Kogan with future speed just on that one's quarters they're followed by Naretva Gold Touch is trapped very wide on the inside of Gold Touch is great power up the inside of the track is Prior Torquan it's still Maximus Wildman the leader for Paul Rhodes from Cairo Casada in future speed in second and third then Naretva uh, Gold Touch and great power trying to run on the still have to Get to this Maximus Wildman and it's Maximus Wildman for Paul Rose who has the advantage with a third and a half to go. Maximus Wildman, another front run here to trying to hold on with Tronson Strong here. Future speed in Cara Crater. Future speed now comes to pick it up for Alex Cherry. Future speed out wide is great power. Future speed wins it from great power in second. Cara Crater was third. Uh, I'm not too sure it was fourth. Uh, fading right out of it was Maximus Wildman. I don't even think that got into the first five in the end. Uh, future speed wins for Alex Cherry from a great power in second for Dave Hoody. Cara Cassidy was indeed uh, third. I think in Dave Hoody's and Dan Hughes is back in fourth for Endangered Beast. Then Miss Mary Pose of a Padre Hogan. Uh, but Alex Cherry picks up a big one, yeah. Cl Clipper Logistic Handicap with future speed. The four-year-old wins from the six-year-old in second for Dave Hoody. Great power.